I've been playing around with my scroll saw setup and I did a cool thing with my foot pedal and I thought that I would share it with you because someone might find it kind of helpful and really it's just because I'm kind of geeking out about it and you guys are the only ones who are going to care. So I posted a little thing about my scroll saw stand that I did the other day with this old microwave cart thing. And, um, but this was my plan. I have a little foot pedal down here that when you press on the pedal, the saw turns on if you plug it into the back. But I got a splitter and I hooked up my scroll saw, my shop back, and uh, aquarium pump to replace the blower, the existing blower. So I'm running a different hose. The little airline hoses for these aquarium pumps are the same exact size. So I took it off and I ran it here. I like to have it on the light thing. Then I could get it closer without dealing with that, uh, the little clampy thing that it was on. And I use my own light because this one's worthless. But I have it all set up, shot back in here saw on so that when I sit down to cut and I press the little button okay right that's pretty cool press the button it all goes on let go it all goes off and you have some nice peace and quiet you don't have to deal with everything running when you don't need it so that's my cool little little thing that I set up and I put some zip ties and stuff to try to keep the cords contained but um, yeah oh and I put a quick release on here with like a bike a little bike thing um, I'm not really sure how much I like it yet one it was really hard to get on two I ended up getting it on crooked uh, but it's okay I don't know I'll play with it for a little bit and <laughs> I'll get back with a verdict to you, but that's my little setup I have right now and I kind of love it. Yeah.